Robert Goddard is generally accepted as the father of modern rocketry. Although rockets had existed for centuries, it was Goddard's advent of liquid fuel propulsion that would one day fly men to the moon. On March 16, 1926, Goddard made his historic launch. At first glance, the rocket's appearance is deceptive. Goddard believed the rocket would be more effective and more stable if its load was pulled rather than pushed. This belief led to the construction of two separate entities, the rocket support and the rocket itself. The rocket is comprised of several different elements, including the oxygen gas cylinder not shown, the gasoline tank, alcohol burner, liquid oxygen or LOX tank, the gasoline line, LOX line, nozzle, combustion chamber, and igniter. To set off the rocket, the igniter and the alcohol burner were lit. Then, pressurized oxygen gas was released into the fuel tanks. This pressure forced the two fuels into the combustion chamber where they ignited. After the rocket left the support frame, it relied on oxygen gas from LOX, heated by the alcohol burner, for continued fuel tank pressure. 